we have a pretty interesting video. It's called Biggest Harms of Anime Characters. And there may be potentially some spoilers, but not to the extent where I think it really matters. All right, let's watch this video. So at first, we have Makoto Mitsumi. Skimichi Moonlit Fantasy at number two. Does that... What do you guys think? Is that okay? Number two? Wait, two girls? Hold up, hold up. We have Tomoe. We got, you know... Oh, fuck. It's been a lot of fucking time. <laughs> Shit. I'm forgetting girls' fucking names. We got Spider Girl. We got Mio. That's right. We got Tomoe. We got the... We, we have, like, Emma 2, the pig. Right? I think Shiki honestly counts part of the harm. He, well, he's down for missing me that, that too. What else do we have? We have like, uh, like Rona might be joined. I think two girls. Nah, I, yeah, actually two girls. That's right. It's, it's just two girls. It's just, it says girls. It's not guys. Yeah, Root doesn't count either. You know what? Okay, okay, this is fine. Next up, we got Mr. Tengen Uzui at three wives. We know that. Rudy is Grey Rat and Mushoku Tensei. <laughs> Again, like, I don't think spoilers like this shit really matters to me because everyone fucking knows what's gonna fucking happen. Keanu, redo of healer. Now, is it accurate to call this guy, like, can you call this actual, like, harem? Aren't they pretty much slaves? Do all five girls in Keanu's party actually, like, enjoy him? How does that matter? I don't know. Next one, this is called The Hidden Dungeon Only I Can Enter. Noir Stardia. <laughs> I don't, I've never seen this. Six girls, the character designs, they look all right. I wonder if it's like a decent show to watch. Next up, Demon Lord Retry, Hakuto Kunai. <laughs> hey, if you're gonna, if you're gonna include one boy here, you gotta include Makoto, bro. Makoto has boys too. <laughs> <laughs> it's Kimichi Miller Fantasy. Uh, he's got five girls and one boy. We have... Oh, this is an OG, OG anime, right? Gintoki Sakata. This is Gintama. This is a long running... What the fuck is this? Hold up. Why is there a grandma here? Why is there this guy? What is going on? What is the grandma wearing the seifuku for? Why is the guy also wearing a seifuku? This is a fever dream of a fucking picture. Next up, Diablo Isekai Mao. Is this wrong way to summon a demon lord? Isekai Mao. Is that the show that almost got voted? Yeah, the one that you guys say that there's like a ridiculous amount of fan service or something, right? Isekai Mao, seven girls. So that, honestly, like these harems are not really much, right? Where's uh, Hyodo at? Where, where's fucking Issei Hyodo? Uh, high School DxD at? Next, my next life as a villainess. A girl has a heart? Whoa. Whoa. Hold up. My next life as a villainess, Katarina Kreis. Seven. Three girls, four boys. Okay, we got some girl harem king representation here. Next up. Realist hero, Soma Kazuya. Eight wives, five more than Tengen Uzui. Next. <laughs> he made it! Bro, he, oh, girl fucking made it for Remonster. This is pretty recent. When was this video posted? Five, oh shit, it is really recent. Five days ago, no wonder. Man, we getting some fucking remonster representation. I can't honestly can't remember the fucking girls' names. They don't really matter. Bro doesn't even know his girls' names until later. I think it's way more than eight, too. It's gotta be way more. Ooh! Ari Fureta. Nagumo Hajime. Eight? Eight? Huh. Okay, I mean, we gotta let the anime and the light novel. I'm sure this is like the end of the light novel or some shit, but like, okay, eight? The fuck? The fuck? Next up Toya Mochiyuki. This is Isek. Oh, smartphone Isek. <laughs> <laughs> this is the smart. A lot of people shit on this smartphone isekai, but I hear it's actually very fun. Maybe one. We'll definitely one day watch it. It'll get voted in one of these days, but there's just too many animes right now. Next up, we have Kimihito Kurusu. Day life with the monster girl. <laughs> Eleven girls. I, what the fuck is this? A slime girl, bro? 
This looks like a harpy girl because I see the feathers. This girl seems to have multiple eyes. I don't know. I can't really tell what these two are at the corners based on this picture alone. <laughs> but this is the one where he has monster waifus, right? I wonder if there's a token trap in that show either. I don't know. Let's see. Next up. To Love Rue, Yuki Torito. 11 girls plus 10 possible candidates. <laughs> 11 girls and 10 possible candidates? So technically 21 if you include those candidates, I guess. What the fuck is going on here? God damn. To Love Rue is... I think this is one of those like really iconic, long-running Echi Haram shows, right? Um, I'm pretty sure this is airing when like I was growing up watching fucking Naruto, One Piece, Dragon Ball. Bleach and shit like that. Never checked it out though. I just thought that this shit's just I don't know. I I, I saw it, I'm like he, he just a bunch of he just with a bunch of kid girls, this is fucking weird. I'm gonna watch my Naruto instead. But uh to Love Ru, it'll be interesting if it ever gets voted in. I'm not sure it can win in our channel. You never know though. If pe I bet people that watch Hunter Girlfriends would watch that shit. Next up. Tomoki Sakurai from Heaven's Lost Property. 11 girls. Uh, very plain looking character. I have no clue what this is. Next up. Kojo Akatsuki. Strike the blood. Senpai. This is our battle. Even I know that line because of how many times it's been spammed in my comment section. Every time Strike the Blood gets mentioned and loses in a poll. <laughs> this shit fucking never wins. It's honestly not even being mentioned in part of the community polls anymore, but one day strike the blood could happen, man. 12 lives? Goddamn. Four times ten, uh, Tengen Uzui. Next! Belkranel! Danmachi 13 girls! Not including the dudes, I think a lot of dudes want him too. There's a lot of girls, man. It's crazy that like, this most recent season that's gonna happen. Well, the most recent that aired was season 4, and that was with Ryu. And you thought that, oh my god, Ryu has... So much connection with Bell. There's, it's it's so intimate trying to survive in the cave together, or the the labyrinth together. And now the next season trailer, bro. They just they just picking up every girl from the fucking bar. Remember that bar that all the girls work at, bro? For whatever reason, a random girl there is the most important girl there now. And I'm like, the fuck? All right, Ryu had her chance. It's the other seer girl's chance. Thirteen girls though. Oh shit! Here it is. Issei Hyodo. High school DxD. We've seen this. Check the playlist out. 15, bro. Eight wives. Seven future harem wives. Honestly, kind of a low number. I expected like 50 plus for whatever reason. That is still a lot. That that, that definitely is a lot. But, you know, I'd expected the Opai Dragon to have a little bit more. Next up. Oh. This, I think, was... It made it onto a poll, but it lost. Yeah. Um, the world God only knows I hear is an amazing, amazing harem. 21 girls. Really? This dude with the glasses? Megane here got it going like that? This is perhaps one of the first Megane main characters that's had a harem. Right? If I go look over the other guys and other characters that's had a harem, this might be the first Megane on the fucking list, bro. Megane got it like that? Okay. Next up. Hida Kizuna. Maso Gakuen HXH. That's definitely not Hunter x Hunter. I have no clue what this anime is. Uh, 25 girls though. That's pretty significant. I mean, that's four more than, you know, this guy right over here. Next up. Negima. Negi Springfield. <laughs> the fuck? Where has the most American white last name? Bro's name is Negi Springfield. <laughs> Alright, Mr. Springfield. 31 girls. 31 girls. Next up. Oh! He's here! That's crazy. You know what the craziest shit is? Dude, we're only like three quarters of the way. Not even like, not even 70% of the way yet. Bro, we're still 60 something percent way and it's, it's still, it's now he shows up? What the fuck is gonna happen later on? Aijo Rentaro, 100 Kanajo, 100 girls. Now, I wonder if the trap girlfriend, if they're ever gonna have one, counts as part of the girls, but goddamn, I can't wait for season two to come back. Next up, one. P what? Kozuki Yoden, 
Now, I'm not really caught up in the Wano shit in One Piece. I, I haven't seen One Piece in a long fucking time. Kozuki Oden, 100 plus girls. Really? I mean, if you look at him, he might be one of the first characters that actually warrants. Like, other than Tenge Uzui, all the dudes here, honestly, they're just a bunch of boys. This is a fucking man. Look at the size of his fucking neck. Now, this is a testosterone filled fucking macho man. Next up, Farming Life. Bro's name is just Hiraku. 155. What? How? How do you have so many girls at a farm? What are you farming? Girls? Bro's literally farming these girls out. They're like fucking vegetables, like fucking fruits he's harvesting. How do you have 155 girls in a show that deals with fucking farming? What the fuck is this shit, dude? Bro's a fertilizer? <laughs> Bro is a fertilizer? What do you fucking mean? Alright. Um, what in the fuck is this? Nagasarate Airanto. Ikuto Tohoin. 200 plus! All girls on the island. So, what? He owns a fucking island? What is this? He owns a fucking island and there's like just one of him and 200 girls. Well, there might be other dudes. There's also a pig over here. There's a huge ass pig nose. 200 girls in the fucking island. Why? What? This is fucking stupid, bro. <laughs> Honestly, at this point, now, I think like e e even like past 100 girlfriends. E no, no. 100 girlfriend, I say, is the beginning of when this shit just gets stupid now. Like, all the guys with the number of girls that they have is gonna go into, like, the power scaling is going into, like, universal territory. This is, like, in the beginning, it made sense. Like, even, like, you know, Makoto having two waifus, Tenge Uzu having three waifus, that's a lot. Bro, we're getting in triple digit territory now. Who's gonna break the quadruple digits? Next up. I don't mind this. Out of context spoils like this, I don't really care because by the time we see this guy in ReZero, I'll have forgotten about him. Regulus Corneas. 291 wives in total. 53 alive? What is this guy all about? Wait, 291 wives, but he has only 53 alive? Is he protecting them? Is he the one killing them? Looking at his face, I feel like he's like a Domus from fucking Demon Slayer where he cuts off beautiful girls' heads. <laughs> what is this? 291, but it's only 53. <laughs> okay, I can't wait to see this guy in the anime then. Reserve coming up very soon, guys, next week. Oh! The Eminence in Shadow. Kage no Sid. Shadow Sama. 700. 100. 712 girls at the moment because it's like all the numbers the name numbers you know and then the actual like top 10 girls like yeah it makes sense like like sids makes sense because it's a whole ass fucking organization where they keep recruiting girls right even though it seems ridiculous that we just jump from 291 to 712 i would argue that this kid having all the girls on the island well then again i haven't seen this anime maybe it also makes sense but like 712 at the moment, we're gonna keep recruiting too. Next. Kensha! <laughs> I told you, it's gonna get stupid now. Here's her first quadruple digit <laughs> entry. <laughs> we, we're in the land of the thousands. Kenshi Masaki from Tenchi Muyo. War on Geminar. What? reason does he have to have 3,000 girls and how the fuck does he possibly keep track of all 3,000? Because let's get serious. Even in Eminence and Shadow, we don't know all 712, bro. At best, we know like fucking 30, right? Like, all the rest of the girls are just random background characters that are part of the organization. What the fuck is happening here? 3,000 girls, dude. Next up, Kamikatsu! Oh! Kamikatsu 10,000? Five digit figure. 10,000 girls and boys. We're in the five digit territory now. Dakini. It's a girl too. Huh. Well, she has. There was another girl before, right? That also made it on. I think it was Katarina Kraeus. It was the uh, uh, reborn as like a villainess or something. But okay, this girl's at 10,000. Who's next? 
Oh. <laughs> the show that we always want to watch in the channel, but honestly, can never gets there. Toaru Majitsuno Index. Here it is. Here's the Index series, bro. I mean, no, people want to watch Railgun. They want to watch Railgun and Accelerator, not Index. But we need to watch like 90 episodes of Index to get to Railgun and Accelerator. That's why it's never fucking happening. Uh, there's girls, including Misaka clones. Misaka from Attack on Titan? No, but I guess that's like feasible with the clones. I wonder how many girls there actually are. And if the clones make up pretty much like, you know, like 9,000 of them or some shits. Next up. World End Harem. Reito Mizuhara. Technically, all the girls in the world, but he's still a virgin. <laughs> what is the point of having a harem where you have all the girls in the world, <laughs> but you're still a virgin? What is the fucking purpose? What is what the author is like, yes, this is a curse. He's gonna have all the bitches, but he can never touch them like that. Is there more? Oh my god, there's still more! There's still fucking more, bro! Okay! What are we gonna go beyond technically all the girls in the world? What is this? Yota Tada. Parallel paradise. All girls in the world. So, like, how do you define or quantify between world and harem and parallel paradise? How many more girls there are? Like, how, why is he beyond Reito? I don't fucking know. Is there any more after this? No, that's it, man. And... <laughs> this is such a stupid fucking video, but I love it. I love charts like this, guys. Please go. This is an anime world video. Please, go give him a like, sub to his channel. I think that as long as we're... I mean, yeah, there's a little bit of spoilers, right? But it's not like... It, I don't really care about spoilers like this. It's just funny, honestly. And I like to cover more charts like this because we used to do this a lot with Emerson Shadow content. But hey, that's it for me. See you on the next one.